Downtown Calumet is packed tonight as people are patiently waiting for the Copper Dog 150 to begin. Local 3's Haley Schongar is live from the starting line. Haley, how's it going out there? Good evening, Rebecca. I'm really excited to watch these dogs get going here very shortly. I am joined by Doug. Doug is with the Copper Dog 150. Doug, thank you so much for being here with me. Haley, thank you for having me. We're so excited to have you here. Awesome. Okay, the day is finally here. Like you just said, how does it feel? Walk me through your emotions. Oh, uh, you know what? Uh, we missed last year uh, because of COVID, of course, and we're back this year. We're so excited. Our theme has been we're home. And uh, man, we hope to see thousands of people here today, and uh, we're going to put on a heck of a show. Yeah, I love that. And I know we've got some UP racers racing in the various races over the weekend. Give us some UP musters we should keep our eye out for. Oh, definitely keep an eye out for Tradells. Um, they're going to do really good in the 80. Uh, you're going to see uh, tomorrow we have a couple mushers that are going to do good. Kelly Joe and uh, Tom Bauer in the 150. He's a local guy, helps us out with our volunteers all the time. And uh, I think he's going to have a pretty fast team this weekend. Yeah, and something we were talking about a little earlier, these mushers get a unique kind of start to the race. Yeah. Tell us a little bit about what some would call walk-up songs in baseball, but the dog sled version. Yeah, this is amazing. One of the things that we're really known for is the mushers have to pick a song, and if they don't pick a song, we give them ABBA Dancing Queen. But yeah, you're going to see country songs, and, and it, it just puts on an extra show for these the folks that are out here and for the mushers to feel good that their their songs kicking them off you know kind of like if you're listening through your your earphones your 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 music and so and the lead dogs are going to announce the lead dogs it's it's amazing yeah i love that and if you could recommend one unique thing from this weekend whether it be a unique spot to watch the dogs pass through or just a one must do thing for copper dog weekend what would it be and why I would say definitely get to some road crossings out there. Um, if you're out tonight, I would go to the snow thermometer. If people are familiar with the snow thermometer on your way up north, um, that's a great spot to watch because you can watch dogs coming through on the trail with their breath, you know, showing and their blinking lights is pretty awesome. And then uh, anytime tomorrow or Sunday at any of the major US 41 road crossings up in Phoenix, a lot of fun. It's going to be a, a big action packed weekend, that's for sure. Yeah, like you just said, action-packed weekend. Give some people the events that they can expect throughout the whole weekend. Absolutely. Uh, it's so exciting. And like I said, we're so happy to be back. And, and please come out and, and check things out. And, and I hope you guys do too. Yeah, awesome. Thank you so much, Doug. Thanks. Rebecca, it is going to be a lot of fun out here. I'm really excited to explore and see what's going on down here in downtown Calumet. But for now, I'm going to send it back to you all in the studio. Reporting live from downtown Calumet, Haley Schongart, Local 3 News.